bubble attack, and the culprits make a clean getaway. This foam waterfall caused hundreds of dollars in damage. News Channel 5's Jeff Skrypek joins us now live in suburban Boca Raton with the Sudsy details. Jeff? Well, Kelly, we found several bottles of this. It's dish soap scattered all around this neighborhood waterfall just near Palmetto Park Road. And while tonight many folks are laughing about the mess it caused surrounding this pool of water, some say it's nothing to chuckle over. It's dangerous. This waterfall should be flowing, but it sits quiet. The reason? These suds floating around, which just prior to being tamed, were bubbling out of control. I thought maybe it was like fake ice or something, but when I got closer, I saw that it was kind of moving. I'm like, no, it's soap suds. This is what Joyce says saw on her way to work driving along Palmetto Park Road. <laughs> never, never seen anything like that before. Feet away from the soapy mess, several bottles of dish soap, a supposed prank that sent huge chunks of white foam right into the road. If it would have gone in my, in front of me, um, you know, on my windshield and I couldn't see, I would have panicked. The bubbles, though, didn't just create a mess for drivers out here on Palmetto Park Road. All of this foam out here in this waterfall could prove very costly to clean up. Loggers run neighborhood management estimates it'll cost several hundred dollars to drain, scrub, and repair the damage that's been done. The HOA didn't want to speak on camera, but sent us this report confirming the potential liability involved and that the sheriff's office was called to help redirect traffic. Joyce Sage says the bubbly joke could have turned sour. You have people that's driving on the highway trying to get to work that could be dangerous. Now the loggers run neighborhood management says they'll have crews out here first thing in the morning to assess all the damages and then from there they'll decide whether or not to file a criminal report. Reporting live tonight in suburban Boca Raton, Jeff Skrypek, WPTV News Channel 5.